Hi guys, welcome back to Dee Dee Stolly Den. Hope you guys are um, doing okay and staying cool because man, it's hot here in Kansas. Anyway, today we have beautiful Anastasia with me. I'll show you, she is dressed in her unicorn dress and her beautiful um, unicorn headband that was sent to her from her, her aunt and uncle in Australia. So I have her with me and then Julian is sitting over there and Jessica is over in the baby bouncer. So why, what I want to show you today is I went thrifting and I got a few things, not a whole lot, but I will show you what I got. But anyway, I thought these were adorable. I am so over summer. I'm ready for fall. So I'm getting in that mood, but I picked these up. Aren't these just cute? They're little bats, slippers. So I found those at the thrift store. Oh, these are from my kitchen. I'm going to wash those. I found these adorable little shoes. They're like a silvery pink. And then we found, I got these for Leila, little brown Mary Janes. And then I found these for the boys. I think these will fit maybe Julian and I know Benjamin can fit them. So I found those. Then we found a few items. I, I, like I said, I didn't find a lot. Oh, I wanted to show you the first item. This one's already been washed because I went to two different thrift stores. Half of that haul has been washed, so I won't be showing all of it. But this here I had to show you because I loved it. My first ugly sweater. I thought this was so cute, and this will fit Mr. Julian and Jessica. Today, we went to Walmart, and my daughter picked this up for me. I just love it. It's newborn. So, my um, little ones can, can wear this, so I was very excited, so I got that. And then at the thrift store, I also found a bassinet. Um... I haven't washed it yet or cleaned it up, but I did find a bassinet. I found this little blue sleeper. It says it's a preemie, which is totally fine because I have a preemie vinyl doll. I could put that on. And then we found this, and it says, I love mommy. Now, I do have to wash these. I held off washing them because I wanted to show them first. This I love. It's got little monsters. I've never seen anything like it. And it says sweet, cute, happy. And then I found this top for Leila. We have some little pants that would go perfect with that. Then I got this. It's Winnie the Pooh. And I fell in love with it. And this will fit Julian. And then I found this for the tiny babies. Got a little poodle on it. I like that. I thought that was cute. And I'm hoping this will fit my new baby that's coming. It has a size, but it's pretty worn. You cannot see the size on it. But it looks small, so I'm thinking this may fit my newborn that's coming. Um, she did ship. She will be here either Saturday or Monday. I would say more for Monday. And then I found this beautiful little sweater. So that's about all I got. But I'm on this um, reborn doll group and it's all reborns. It's not just, you know, artists made. It's for the knockoffs or the copycats as people call them. And there is these three women that come in there and this woman was asking about buying the Mila kit from Timu. And they tore her up and was saying that that's a fake baby. You don't want to buy those. They have chemicals in them and all this stuff. And I'm like, why are these admins allowing that to go on when this is an all doll page? But these women have done this before because I got into it with these very same women. I recognize the names immediately. They are artists. They are from the UK and they are not very nice. And they go in there and they rip on these poor girls. The girls love babies. They can't afford to get 
the artist dolls. I understand that because that's why I have a lot of these copycats. I don't really care where my babies come from and I don't care what people think, but don't go in and rip on people because they, they have their own choice. And the woman come back at her and says, all babies need love. All dolls need love. And this woman was still tearing her apart for her. I didn't say anything because I'm hoping the admin will see it and do something about it. If not, I'll be contacting the admin myself because these women have done this on multiple Facebook pages that are all dolls. I mean, if you want artist dolls, then you need to go to the artist page, you know, where you only can show your artist made dolls, not pages that are for all dolls because it's not right. And it's not fair to the other women. That's how I feel about that. Anyway, rant over. I gotta drink some tea, guys. I'm thirsty. I don't drink sugar in my tea. I don't like sugar in my tea. So anyway, I want to get on here and show you what I have purchased or what I had purchased. I will show the bassinet after I get it cleaned up. So I'm gonna get off here. You all have a wonderful night, and I'll talk to you all later. Bye.